Hello and welcome to Brides Berks. Today it's Ava here and today we're going to be doing another one of the little Christmas builds. Now I did miss about a week back there. Right, I have a reason to explain. I was in eight shows so I really couldn't do it but I will catch up. I will try my best to try and get 24 done. Um, but today we're going to build the snowflake and okay so I'm using lots of hinges and I'm just going to make this little base shape. It's sore to get like straight kind of like not straight I don't know how to explain it like equal distances apart so I'm just gonna put some on some transparent it's a trans transparent yeah translucent is only semi transparent or something I don't know those are transparent bricks and now I'm going to be putting on these so this book is is not an instruction book it's an ideas book so a lot of this here isn't like that clear from where I'm looking from so I'm really kind of making up a lot of this as I go like I know this is the same but those last bricks, I'm not sure. I'm just kind of making up the attachment there. I'm not sure how strong this is going to end up, but I'm just going to have to go for it. So um, it doesn't actually show how you attach these onto the center part. Um, so that's going to be a lot of trial and error. <laughs> Maybe I should have um, tested this before I recorded it, because I didn't. Um, I just sat out and got all the pieces. It was quite um satisfying. Oh, oh oops, dropped my camera. Nothing happened. Um, okay, so we're putting all these little rounded bits onto these. So these blue jumper studs weren't in the original, but I couldn't think of how else to get the whole thing to stay together. So I just added them in instead. And I'll put something on them later, maybe. Um, yeah, that looks kind of straight, I guess. So now I will just be able to... Oh, no, I'm going to turn them all the way around. No. Okay, so... And then you can just attach them on like so. There you go. And there's a bit of a gap... But I can always add something to it after if I really want to. Because it won't fit down lower. And there's no point in me putting it any lower. I don't know if it makes any sense in there. But okay, I've got them all. Oh my god, it's so breakable. It's so um loose. Okay. um Right, let me just add some of these little things. And the whole way around the outside. um I have loads of them. I don't know what that transition was. But um that was really bad transition but we're gonna go with it um so i've got attached them all on now i'm going to add some to the bottom of it that actually looks so pretty when we stacked when i stacked them there uh like that yeah so they're gonna be facing out sorry this is so um slow it kind of takes me like a while to figure it out sort of so as i said earlier um i haven't been posting the last week now i was trying to do it once one every day and it's a little countdown to christmas instead of doing an advent calendar but i have been in it shows and i've had dress rehearsals on monday and tuesday and then i have a show um wednesday thursday friday saturday to each day so i have been so busy and i haven't been able to post this week but i will try my very very best to um get 24 done in total so that means i'll probably have to do two every day this week or something like that but i will try my best to get 24 done it's just been really hard for me at the minute because i'm being so busy um so this is day is this day four five maybe something like that and then um it words when i'm recording this it is the 10th i think or the 11th maybe i'm not even too sure but like i am a good bit behind but i will try my best to catch up so putting on these pieces it's kind of repetitive oh wrong way these are like really hard but the angle i'm recording this at to get them done so it does look like a snowflake but it is like so flimsy so fragile sorry about that I have to just do a little bit of asmr so um as i said this is a very fragile build at the minute it's not strong at all um, and these cheese buzzers are so repetitive. I really hope this pays off because it's so much work. Not just putting on the pieces, but finding them. Oh my gosh, I spent so long looking for all these little bits and pieces. Because I've got about like 24 of these or something. I don't know. There's just a lot of them. We have got like the base of the snowflake finished at least now. Um, But like there's still like a lot to do to like structure it. Gosh, I'm saying like so much. <laughs> Sorry. But there's um, a lot of structuring that needs done because it's so, so fragile. Okay, I am trying to come up with something else. If I put these underneath, it might work because it's not working the way it is. I might nearly broke it whenever I like wanted to put my hand up to the camera. Then I was like trying to think about a way of doing it and I nearly broke it. So I did come up with this way and 
Oh gosh, everything's falling apart. I've made a mess. Nothing is working. Oh no. Okay, that part worked, I guess. And I'm just breaking apart. Uh oh, how do I attach this now? Um Let me see if I put these on. And then could I put the in between ones at a different height or something? Because they don't all fit right beside each other because the angle it's on, I can't put a brick on the next one. Oh no. Unless I put it like a brick lower. I don't know if I'm making any sense. I have no clue what to do here. Um oh no. Another big thing I'd like to say is recently um, on our YouTube channel, we've been getting a lot more views in some of our videos. And at the minute, we have 60 subscribers. I cannot believe it. So I just have to say a big thank you to all of our new subscribers. And subscribe if you want to see a part two to this video. Bye.